drive a sports car just to prove I'm a real big ball because I made a million dollars and I spent it on girls and shit. But you don't want to be high and like me. Never let me know why you got to be. You don't give a one step off that you would have closed to it. All the Lord wants. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, what's up? Um, so this is my 4th of July look. I kind of wanted to just do something super fun, super bright, super obnoxious, just like me. Dang. Lots of color. I'm always super, really, like, super festive when it comes to, like, 4th of July. Like, I always have to wear a red, white, and blue outfit. So I figured I'll wear a simpler outfit this year and just go crazy with the makeup. Uh, if you guys want to see how to get this look, how I get these crazy eyes going on, uh, just keep watching. Thanks, guys. Alright, guys, so first I'm going in with the Benefit the Poor Professional Pore Minimizer to minimize my big ass pores. Then I'm going to go in with the Pro Concealer, starting with the green to cover up some of the redness in my cheeks and some of the little tiny pesky ass pimples. <laughs> And then I'm gonna, I have my beauty blender back, if you can't tell, so I'm blending that shit in with the beauty blender. So excited to not have to use a brush. Now we're going in with that bright ass orange under my eyes to cover up my fatty uh, under eye circles. I couldn't think of the word. And then I'm going to put some concealer on top of that just because it's so orange. It's, it's so orange. Now I'm going in with my new favorite foundation it is the Clinique beyond perfecting foundation and concealer and I am the color 2 alabaster this freaking foundation is amazing I'm obsessed with it I I, I can't stop I just love it you know I just, I just freaking love it now my mom uses it now my grandma uses it it's just amazing now we're going to go in some with, with some concealer. I'm going in with a little bit of a darker one just to kind of help conceal some of my darker under eye circles. I'm going in with Bare Minerals Bare Skin in the color Medium. Then I'm going to go in with that Calvin Klein. And I don't know what color it is. It's like a 3-in-1 concealer corrector. I don't know. It's very light. That's what it is. It's very light. This is this. It's number two, I guess. I don't know, guys. I'm sorry. Then I'm gonna set my under eye, and now I'm gonna bake. This is, this is like maybe my third time baking. Yeah, you gotta bake, you gotta bake the mustache because under my nose and above my lip, woo, does it get sweaty. And you gotta dance a little, of course, yeah, dance it out. Now we're gonna go in with my It Cosmetics, and everything on it is like gone, so I couldn't even tell you what palette it is anymore, to be honest. But I'm gonna go in with that like warmth color and then I'm gonna go in with this Alme in the color. Oh my god, why aren't they making it easier to see these colors? God damn it. <sighs> Alright, well it's a dark blue, as y'all can tell. Now I'm gonna blend it. Blend that color all out the corner of my eye. Or the outside of my eye. Good god, it's early this morning, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> now I'm gonna go in on the other eye. Blend that, of course. Now we're going to go in with the NYX Avant Pop Palette. And I'm going to go in with that like bright blue color. And then I'm going to blend it in with the darker blue color. Then I'm going to set or put some concealer underneath that so there's a nice sharp line because I want a nice sharp, sharp line. Then I'm going to go in with the bright white in the pop avant pop palette blend that out so there's not super harsh lines then i'm going to go in with like a silver to just kind of make it a little bit brighter a little more sparkly at this point i got so tired of looking at myself with all that white on my face so i just i just wiped it off so it's done but it works y'all it really does now i'm going to do the other eye with the white And then throw that silver on too. Apparently I didn't keep that in. <laughs> Blend it. Oh, yeah. That's cute, Dana. So cute. This is um, from NYX Primal Colors. And this is in the hot red color. See? There's a color there. Hey, look at that. I'm going to put that under my eyes. Just a little, little red pop. I'm going back in with that It palette. And the color is like a midnight. 
like a dark, dark blue, and I'm gonna put that on my waterline. Now this is a white NYX felt uh, tip eyeliner. I do not like felt tips, but I do like them for helping me like find like an outline of where I want to do my eyeliner, so that's kind of what I'm using this for. But other than that, I no, I hate felt tip liners. At least all the ones that I've used, I just freaking hate. Now we're going in with the liquid uh, white eyeliner from NYX, just to kind of fill in that line that I already drew. Ooh, cute girl. All over, and it always gets on my lashes. If y'all know how to like avoid that, please do tell me because that shit gets everywhere. I'm gonna go in with a black elf liner, just kind of outline the very, very edge of it. And at this point, I was so over eyeliner. Like, does that ever happen to you guys? Because that happens to me all the time. So I kind of just decided to do the white on the other side, and then I just kind of gave up on it, not gonna lie. I had to take a break. <laughs> See, there, there it goes, all over the freaking lashes again. See, this is where I took a break. So I took the NYX Contour and Highlight Palette, and I put that like pinky peach highlight underneath my brows to highlight my brows. Then I finally went back in with that black elf liner to outline the other eye. Now this took me so long and I had to fix it so many freaking times. See, there goes one, there goes one. And I probably fixed it like three or four times, but I just kept one in because that was just so excessive. Now we're gonna curl those white beautiful lashes <laughs> and put some mascara on this is bare minerals lash domination i put my lashes on off camera not on purpose but whatever so i'm going back in with that nyx contour and highlight palette just kind of use this real techniques brush to get where i want it done where my want where i want my line done and then i'm gonna blend it out I'm going up on that forehead because that forehead's got to be bronzy too, if you know what I mean. Mm. Then of course blend that out too. And now my nuge. Just a little tiny brush for this. Blend, blend, uncle. Mm. And now the final part, the chinny chin, chinny chin chin. <laughs> Now I'm gonna go with like a banana powder from that palette. Just go under my eyes a little bit, my forehead, my nose. Now I'm going in with a Bare Minerals blush. I don't know the color of it. I'll put that in the, the bar. Now for the lips, I'm using the Rimmel London Exaggerate Full Color Lip Liner in the color Red Diva to line my lips. I actually really like this liner. It goes on really easy, really smooth. I like the little twist up action it gives you and then I broke it good job Dana I'm awesome then I'm going in with the Maybelline color blur in the color 30 partner crimson something like that I don't know it's bomb I love this crap it goes on so easy it's pretty matte considering there's like there's not like a lot of shine to it not it's not glossy it's like a lipstick and I love it you know now some mascara to kind of help my lashes stick to my falses because that's a very important step now the highlight i'm going in with that white highlight from that palette and just run that all over and then of course set your face uh i hope you guys liked this video if you did give it a big old thumbs up i got so much makeup on my hands it's ridiculous uh, also, please subscribe to my channel because I got lots of awesome makeup looks coming at you. Plus, I've got lots more videos for my hashtag 30 days of YouTube. Super excited on those. Uh, and I think that's all I really have to say. Bye, guys.